Okay, today I just want to do a brief video on how I set my mirrors in my car. Um, I can't believe how many people I pull up to and I can see their face in their mirror. Um, that means their mirror is pointing in, pointing behind, directly behind their car and they can see that in the rear view mirror. So I'm going to show you how I set mine up. I know nobody ever taught me this as far as driver ed or anything, but I read it somewhere or whatever. Anyway, I've been doing it for a couple years. It works really, really well, and it it's just so much safer for me. Okay, so obviously your rear view mirror, you know, don't point it towards your face like these chicks do when they're putting on their makeup and stuff. Adjust that so when you're sitting comfortably, you're looking out most of the back of your your window. You, you know, left, right, uh, up, down, whatever. You want to see most is the best view you can get out there. That's that's pretty obvious. Most people can figure that one out. Okay. Now here's where here's what I do. You have this little adjustment down here, left, right, up, down for your left and right mirrors. My left mirror, my driver's side mirror over here. What I do if I'm sitting, this is this is I'll put this right by my head. If I'm sitting here, I'll tilt. I'll turn it. I'll tilt at the waist. I'll bend at the waist to the left, and the top of my hair is almost hitting the glass okay so again sitting here bend left at the waist so that your hair is you know you, you can feel your hair hitting the glass when you do that then adjust your mirror out so that you can only see a little bit of your car here on the inside you want all of it showing on the left you just want to see a little bit of your car you don't want to see the whole side of your car down there just a little bit in that point now mine's a little maladjusted right now because I was playing with it for this video. But what that does for you then is when you sit back up and look out, you're looking way over here into that lane coming up beside you, which is your blind spot. You're not looking down the back of your car. I mean, if you want to see behind you, look in your rear view mirror, okay? I can already see behind me. I want to see the blind spot to the left. Okay, same general concept for the passenger mirror. Sitting here, bend at the waist to the right, so my head, you know, I'm, I'm sideways now, and my head is about centered in the center of the car, the console, and now I look over here, and look at that. You can just see down the side of my car in that little point in the mirror. All the exposure is to the right out in that other lane. So now when I sit back up to a comfortable position, I'm looking further over there I'm looking into that lane into that blind spot and now I'll try to do a video out on the highway safely that shows you why this works really well for driving safely so what does this do for me well watch the guy in my rear view mirror I can see him in the rear view mirror until he comes up when he disappears off the left of my rear view mirror so I can't see him anymore If I turn my head, he's now appearing in my side mirror. And when he disappears from my side mirror, I now see him coming up right beside me in real life. While I can see him coming in my rear view mirror, when I stop seeing him to the left of my rear view mirror, he appears over in my side mirror. And when he no longer appears in my side mirror, he's on me. Again, watch this guy coming up on the left, behind my hand, he's gone, he appeared down here, and now he's right here beside me. 